tomorrow, Thursday, August 8th, 2024, will officially mark 10 years since FNAF or just Five Nights at Freddy's was released to Steam. And I, 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 I have no words. Like, I, I've been a fan, or a fan, like, I've just followed it. Like, I was a fan when I was, like, 9, 10 years old when the game came out. It was around a few months, like, not even a few months after when I didn't, I wasn't a day one person for FNAF, but I, that Christmas of 2014, around Christmas break is when I watched that infamous video of Markiplier. If I don't want to stay more than one night, well, I don't know what he said. But that video was just iconic for Five Nights at Freddy's. And don't forget, Yammy Mash, a forgotten creator, he told Markiplier that it was really, really good. <laughs> but I am just wanted to tell you all this because some of you may have just never heard of the game, which I'm a little bit surprised. But um, the, the FNAF movie came out, um, I think, October of last year. It wasn't really well reviewed. I never watched it, but I kind of know the lore of FNAF. And what really got me is I I saw the end credits like on YouTube. They actually used the original song up, uploaded a few weeks after the game launched in 2014 by The Living Tombstone. And that video has like oh, well over 300 million views at this point. But that's kind of crazy to think about. That those songs I grew up on are nostalgic now. And I just wanted to let you all know this. Now, Scott Cawthon has been kind of a the, the creator of this game, of this franchise, of this series. Uh, he has been saying some, I guess, controversial things. Sometimes I agree, sometimes I don't. So what? Agree to disagree. But anyway, um, thank you, Scott, for all the all the laughs over the years and you know this i love this game when i was like 10 and i thought it was creepy it was pretty unique at the time i remember another game that came out about a year maybe about a year before it in 2013 called outlast and you know it was horrifying honestly it scared the shit out of me when i was 10 years old and five nights was like it made you felt kind of helpless like you just couldn't move yet you, you just had to wait of course the the formula has ran dry now you know it's kind of stale but at the time it was one of the scary the it was the the game of the internet the horror game in 2014 and 2015 N no one could get enough and i just want to say again thank you scott for everything Peace out, Scott. Peace out, audience. Peace out, um, Shada. <laughs> Me, your humble narrator. And have a nice day. Enjoy the 10-year anniversary.